Hey there everybody, I'm Sigurd Campos and today I have a question uh, for everybody. Is a 20 strikeout game harder than a perfect game? Okay, so uh, first of all, harder doesn't mean more relevant. I think a perfect game is way more important than a 20 strikeout game because you can, I mean, I don't give a damn if you pitch to contact and throw a perfect game, it's still impressive. And a 20 strikeout game is a stylistic achievement. I mean, it's only uh, possible for a certain type of pitcher, which is, of course, the power strikeout pitcher, you know, the Max Scherzers, the Randy Johnsons. Um, but here's the thing a 20 strikeout game is less probable than a no hitter, sorry, than a perfect game. There have been 23 perfect games in Major League history and only five 20 strikeout games done by four pitchers, which are Kerry Wood. Roger Clemens, Max Scherzer, and Randy Johnson. Of course, Roger Clemens did it twice. Doesn't really count, but whatever. Um, so here's the thing with a perfect game. A perfect game is based on luck. It's, it's based on hitters' mistakes. It's based on... I mean, of course, there is a ton of merit for whatever pitcher throws a, a perfect game. Because, I mean, you need to be talented, but you need to be lucky. I mean, here's the thing with a, with a 20 strikeout game. If you, if you strike out 20 hitters, there are only 7 possible outs left for you to allow contact. And in a perfect game, there's no limit. You could throw a perfect game with a, without a single strikeout. So, whenever a hitter makes contact there is a complete massive variety of options that can happen with the ball. Um, it can, I mean, whatever, I don't know. I mean, it, anything can happen when you hit a baseball. So, the thing with a 20-strikeout with a game is that you do not allow contact. I mean, it's basically not contact but for that you need to have the stuff the power stuff the strikeout stuff to not allow contact and that is i mean that's hard to hard to catch you know hard to see um the thing is that a 20 strikeout game is more of an individual effort i mean to be honest a, a perfect game um yeah i mean you you can get um uh, i don't know 10 strikeouts, that's 20, that's 17 outs uh, for your defense, and that's a team effort. I mean, if, if your shortstop wasn't there, you wouldn't be getting the outs, right? I mean, we've all seen, um, I mean, this was a no-hitter, but the, the catch on Jordan Zimmerman's no-hitter, first no-hitter in Nationals history, uh, Sosa makes that catch. That's luck. I mean, to be honest, I mean, it, of course it's Sosa's skill, but it's luck for Zimmerman. Um, the thing here with the, the um, 20 strikeout game, it's based on proper execution and sequencing. You have to be smarter to throw a 20 strikeout game. I mean, and I know it's it's crazy to say that considering Max Scherzer has a has a strikeout game, a uh, twenty strikeout game. He's a he's not a smart pitcher, but he got a twenty strikeout game. Um, I mean, of course, he might be the most talented pitcher in the history of the game. He's just not a smart guy. But execution, based on proper execution, that's the big word here, because Max Scherzer is a master of execution. He executes everything perfectly he doesn't he cannot sequence for sh but he is a very good executioner when he's on the mound and yeah that's the thing you know um the thing with a perfect game here it's based on missed mistakes i mean a hitter makes a mistake and you swing at it wrong and you hit a roller to second base and you you are out and you know that's it's based on missed mistakes 
But uh, 20 strikeout game is based on execution and sequencing. So the final verdict here. Um, is a 20 strikeout game harder than a perfect game? I believe it is. First of all, it has happened less times, like way less. Only five times compared to 23. Second, it's an individual effort. In a team sport, an individual effort has more weight around it. And of course, yeah, there are stylistic advantages, but it's based on skill. It's not based on luck. So yeah, definitely a 20 strikeout game is harder than a perfect game. However, perfect games get more respect in the baseball community for some reason. I mean, I guess the word perfect is a bit polarizing. Uh, but the 20 strikeout game, it's harder. It's objectively harder than a perfect game. I mean, look at the numbers. It, there's a reason why a perfect game has happened more times than a 20 strikeout game. It's because there are more lucky pitchers than there are good pitchers. And good pitchers get 20 strikeouts. Well, with a certain style. Good pitchers with a certain style can get a 20 strikeout game. Lucky pitchers, no matter what style you have, you can throw a perfect game. So there you have it. I believe it's harder to throw a 20 strikeout game than a perfect game. And that's going to do it for today. I hope you like, comment, share the video, subscribe. And of course, I will see you in the next one. Goodbye. Thanks for watching.